Okay, Sean, what are we doing here? So we're here on a strike at the Manadero McDonald's out in South Auckland. And uh, so what's oh, what's happening? Uh, with Is there a picket line here or what? Yeah, so we've got a picket line. We've got two picket lines. Uh, one pretty much guarding the entrance to the drive through and one that's guarding entrance to the McDonald's car park itself. Right. And um, we're just asking other customers that want to come and eat at McDonald's, we're asking them if they could go somewhere else to KFC or anything like that. Um, you know, just being across the road, uh, if they can just shop somewhere else. So the company can lose money and the company can lose customers. Um, so they can pretty much feel hurt and, you know, so they can understand, you know, what we're going through. Right. And how effective is this picket line here? As well, we're, we're probably drawn about, around uh, about 80% of customers. So that's pretty good. 80% of customers are, yep, are deciding driving. deciding not to cross the picket line. Yeah, 80% of customers are deciding not to cross the uh, picket line um, in support and in solidarity for other McDonald's workers at the store and other stores across the country. That's outstanding. That's really outstanding. Uh, okay, so we were talking to somebody earlier. This is not your store, is that correct? But no, this ain't my store. I'm just supporting the other McDonald's workers who are part of the union at the store. Um, you know, because you know, one McDonald's worker is you know, maybe a worker, but they're also friends within the McDonald's um, employee um, group. Um, so one supports each other, and same thing with the union. Part of the union, we support you, and I support you, and I'll be at every single strike as possible as I can. Great. And so, what what's happening in the store? Do you know? Um, in the store, they've got uh, quite, they hired a lot of staff. Um, to work tonight um, because they were unaware which store exactly was going to go on strike. Um, they assumed that it was going to be Manukau, but it was actually Manurewa. So in the store there, there's probably less customers in there, um, considering that the majority of the customers are actually driving and trying to come for the drive through um, But at least we can see the drive through it's hurting them much because that's where they gain more of the money from. Right, so the drive-thru is the big uh, is the big money spinner for them, is that yeah. right? Yeah, it's the big rev uh, revenue um, gatherer for them um, to earn more money so they can get done quicker and serve more customers and get more money. Right, so the people on the picket line are uh, tr are persuading customers not to uh, not to come through, but if they really do insist, they are being let through. Is that correct? Yeah. So if they if they There's you know if they really there. want um, them to support, that's some great solidarity. Yeah, Sorry about if, the interruption. If they um if if they do want to come through and they still want to eat, you know that's fine for them. But that means that shows why an extra person doesn't care about other workers, and they might be a worker themselves. And if they go on strike, and, you know we recognise them. From not supporting us, then we won't support them. Right. So that uh, that really is the thing. I mean, it, it's about it. It's about uh, persuading people. Yep. And, and it's also engaging with the community and letting them know. You know, we, we can't stand for you know how much we get paid, the hours we get, and pretty much for all the issues and problems that's gathering at each and in, um, every individual store, franchise owned, company owned. Um, and you know, most of the people here on strike are not just from Manilio and McDonald's, but also from Key Street, Cape Queen Street, uh, Britain Marts, and a whole range of other stores across the country as well. Excellent, John. And have you got a message for uh, the workers who are just feel a little bit intimidated uh, about you know coming out? Yeah, so the uh, workers that are part of the union that are inside the stores now at Manurewa and McDonald's and you haven't come out to the strike, you know, it's you may feel intimidated because the head office people are there, your restaurant manager and your senior management and there's a whole lot of managers there, but don't feel intimidated because if they intimidate you, let us know and we'll pretty much go on the case and provide a personal grievance to them. Um, but, you know, we're all here to support you no matter what. Excellent. Thanks. And uh, thanks too from Unite Union. That's right. Thanks. Good night.